how do you create value, bring value to a buyer if you aren't leading with content? All right, let, let, let's do a live review of what this looks like. So uh, first on my screen, we're going to look at this. Now, remember, uh, Jason, we're not going to use the name. We're just going to call him Bob, right? Bob. All right. And we're not going to say the company name because all of this stuff will be blurred out by our designer as we go through this. All right. So we're looking inside. I'll make this a little bigger. Now, Bob sends me a, a message, first message on January 15th, 2024. This is at 4.34 p.m. UTC time. I have no idea what that is in Pacific Standard Time, but I'm going to assume that that is uh, that's within my time my time range. Now, Bob says to me, hey, we just came across Fly Message while searching for top tier AI tech firms in the country. So I wanted to reach out to you. We just boosted Gamma AI to 1.9 million views with only $3,000 spent hitting $1.60 uh, six, cost per, uh, what does the CPM stand for? Cost per? First per thousand. Okay. Now, that, now this highlights actually a very specific problem. What the heck is CPM, right? If you're targeting me, the CEO, do I know these level of details? Uh, I, uh, so this is what we got to think about as, as, as a seller, right? Uh, so hitting a one, $1.660 CPM in 60 days with our new influencer marketing flywheel. Interested to hear how we can do this for Fly Message? All right, let's look at this one first. What do you think? First off, what- My what, what? first impression, and I'm, I'm curious, the, the photo above caught my attention, Mario. Is that part of that or is this a different- No, no, no. So this is a reply okay. to the reply. That's, so that's, that's why Okay, we, so it's going yeah. back. Okay, I got it. Yeah, so we're going to focus so, just on this piece right here. So first off, I think there's too much jargon to your point, right? So like, like if I'm getting it, if I don't know what Gamma AI is, like is that his company? Is that a client they've helped? Right? So who is, who is Gamma? Like what does that mean to me? I don't know, right? So that's first part of it. The second part is- what does the spend really matter? I mean, ultimately, because I don't know what you did for them, right? So it's like you boosted them, but what did you do? Did you do work that took, you know, a week or, you know, three months, you know, and what did, they, what did you get for three three grand? So you're talking about what, what were the results? What were the results? I mean, like, you don't, yeah, like, what did you do and what were the results to get there? You know, you, you so that's a little confusing. And then lastly, who is this guy, right? So is this just a made up person? There's no title. Like even with our emails, like there's a title there, you know, so we know and a company name, you know, even there may not be a link. So I think when I see these, I always delete these right away. I don't even kind of scan them when I, it just says one name at the end. To me, that's like a red flag and I just toss them aside. Okay. All right. Good. A uh, couple of things that, that I'll, I'll bring out here. First off, I did like the Hey Mario. Uh, because if they follow anything I do, personality insights indicates that I would say, hey, Mario, and I, I engage with people just like that. So I like the informal model there. Uh, he writes, just came across fly message. That was an instant turnoff. Wait, you just came across and you didn't do any research? Or how about a better way to say this is, I've been spending some time looking at fly message and I downloaded it. Right. Now, if you were a true seller that was personalizing this and taking this uh, to, to, to drive interest, you would recognize that when you write just came across your company, that that means absolutely nothing. But if you actually say to me as the CEO that you're targeting, Hey, I'm a customer. Now, do you think I'm going to blow off a customer? And this is what I don't understand about salespeople. It co costs you nothing to download our tool and it takes less than five minutes to install it. Do you think that I would be willing to respond to somebody who says, I just downloaded Fly Message while I was looking at top tier AI technology firms, and I love what you're doing, especially using it on LinkedIn? Would that, would that catch my attention? Would that be super hyper personalized, Jason? Yeah, of course. And the, and the funny thing is, is that, you know, clearly this is an automated email, right? But if you reach out to Arian, and you said, hey, I'm interested, let's talk. He'd be like, who's Fly Message? Like, he probably doesn't even know who you are, right? Because he didn't send this, the system sent it. So to your point, you know, like you, yeah, we can read right through it. Yeah, it's got the Hey Mario. I think, you know, yeah, it's casual. Um, but yeah, it comes across as like, it's just fill in the blank of information. Exactly nothing. right. 
and you nailed it, right? So the first, like, like I'll give Bob a, a, a minute here to say, hey, at least you said, hey, Mario, and you realize my tone of voice would be, I would accept that, right? Uh, but but the flip side is, is you just came across Fly Message? Like, bro, like, don't tell me you just came across it. That means you didn't do your research. And while researching top tier AI tech firms, God, I mean, come on now, you're, you're, you're trying to stroke my ego, but we're a pre-seed uh, uh, venture capital funded company. Are, are we really a top tier AI tech firm? Where did you see that at? And by the way, in the entire country? Like, come on now. All right. So to your point, I love what you said, though. Who the heck is Gamma AI? I have no idea what that means. And you boost them to 1.9 million of views with only $3,000 spend. But what was the impact? Right. That's what I don't understand here. So they basically got $3,000 with a spend to get 1.9 million views. Wait, did that actually mean that they increased the pipeline by $10 million? Did they close out any deals? Did they fill in the blank? What's the benefit to your point? Now, he writes, interested to hear how we can do this or fly message. Of course, I was not. Inside of here, he left no value to me. No link, no nothing. I didn't know who they were. And to your point, he put his last, his first name as Bob. Right. I don't know who Bob is, other than the fact that I see that they are an agency. Now, I'm going to leave it at that, a very generic. All right. So that was January 15th. Now, here it comes. January 17th at 448 UTC time. All right. Hey, Mario, comma, enter, enter. Just following up to make sure you saw this. Let me know. <laughs> All right. What do you think about that message from Bob? What do I think about the message from Bob? I think that it's, uh, you know, if the first one was bad, this one's way worse. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, so a lot of companies, interestingly enough, a lot of organizations put things in like Mario, question mark, or... I'm following up to make sure you got this. Did you see it? Let me know. Yeah. Wait, who the heck are you? Right. Bob, I, you are at the bottom of my priority list. The bottom. So why do you think that I owe you a response? That's my response as a buyer. Right. Any other feedback? Uh, no, I think you 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 nailed it all. I, I don't think there would be anything differently, I would say. Um, now, the only thing I would say here is it came two days later, literally almost 24 hours uh, to mm -hmm. the T, right? So it was 24 hours and it looks like uh, uh, 14 minutes. Which is way too soon. I, I agree with you. Because at this point, uh, you're, if you recognize the buyer, I'm the CEO of my company. It might take me two days just to get you your, 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 your email. And now I'm irritated that you're basically blowing up my box. And all the while, there's no unsubscribe link. So they're using a a a um, sequence that doesn't have the unsubscribe, and now I'm getting more irritated. All right, let's look at the next one that came in. Which By the is... way, Mario, I'll just interject that I've got a great pre-written response that um, I'll share with you. Um, we could even, you know, in the post-production, share with your listeners that I just type in the word spam to my email, and it just puts in this whole long message, you know, in there. Um, to just try to get people because that's really, I mean, obviously it's against can spam policy. You have to have an unsubscribe link in your email. It's illegal not to have one. So, um, so that's something that, you know, I just have fun with these people. Yeah. <laughs>